If you've been on this channel before, you know that Titanfall has a special place in my heart. I'm not a great Titanfall player, but I love it. And it's come to Steam, and it's now the top selling game on Steam. Look at this right now, 13,000 players online. I've never seen it this high ever since I've ever played this game. So this is really good news because there's so much content in this game. We have many different game modes. We have also like this PvE mode. We have this like 1v1 Colosseum style mode and of course the awesome, awesome campaign. Now I'm going to just jump in. I'm just going to press play MP. Um, there's so much stuff to play. I really do think that if you've ever wanted to play Titanfall 2 and you've never really known whether or not to, now is the best time, right? Like my biggest concern with this game is I'm not that great and there are a lot of veterans that have been grinding this game for a long time and I cannot compete with them and with such a small player base that becomes an issue but now that it's on steam you know there's a lot of newer players jumping into the fray and i don't have to feel so bad about playing so badly because i'm not going to be the only one playing badly so right now we have got a loadout we have set ourselves with a grapple um this is a lot of fun if you like pathfinder you're really gonna like this one i've gone for a wingman elite it's like a two-shot kill and then a charge rifle for the anti-titan weapon and uh, we may as well just stick another wingman on there oh we don't have enough mana, so that's fine we probably won't use that anyway um so let's just jump in have some fun my titan is also a ronin i do like the ronin um ah oh, look at this that'd be nice maybe in the future we'll get some nice camos this game really is something else and I just, I mean, yeah, you just watch the gameplay and you can decide for yourself if it's worth playing. Um, yeah, there we go. Oh, wow. So the, the aim of this game, I think we're playing attrition right now. Oh, um, is to kill as many people as you can, get as many points as you can. You can also kill like AI soldiers, right? Um, okay, well. Yeah, we're dead. Oh. Yeah, you gotta get points and then you charge up your Titan meter. You wanna call in your Titan as quick as possible and just cause havoc. Where's this player? Oh, that's fine. Oh dear, my aim isn't great. It feels a bit strange like transitioning to Apex, uh, from Apex, surprisingly. But yeah, the time to kill is really quick because you basically wanna be moving around like a crazy person, all right? That's all you're really doing here. As a player, let's try and take that. Obviously, you get more kills for player kills, so that's what we want to aim for here. <laughs> like, as you can see, my aim is not great, but it's fine. It's fine. Jeez. I'll get him. I'll get him. The w weird thing is with the Wingman Elite is... When you ADS, it just feels way too zoomed in. Um, if you upgrade it, can you change the optic on it? I, I know you can with other weapons. Like, I don't know, man. Oh, that was a nice shot. Oh. Okay, so our Titan is now 74%. Oh, he just got destroyed. All right, we got our first time we tighten. Oh god, we're alert. Let's get out of here, shall we? Yeah, this is not really a suitable weapon. For this. Oh god, he's finishing me. <laughs> the finishes in this game are insane. Now, if you're more of a fan of the um, no, 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 no. Now, if you're more of a fan of the, like, non-Titan action, you can just go straight into Pilots v Pilots. And now there's an actual decent player base. You can find a game very fast. Let's see how that long this takes. Let's make it wait 10 seconds. That is beautiful. I like the movement in Titanfall. I'm not great at it, but I like it. And that's, you know, that's what I'm here for. So I'm not such a big fan of the Titans, honestly. So it's great to see this mode exists. And now there's more players. We can finally play it. So I'm happy about that. 
This game's pretty straightforward. It's basically like a death match. You just have pilots. It's like it, you know? Oh, yeah. Cool. The, the time to kill in this game is so fast because, I mean, it's just hard to hit people. So what you need to do is just be as hard to hit as possible. So the difference between this movement and Apex is you can, you have a jump pack um, and you can basically double jump everywhere. So you can go like this, boom. And also, as you'll see right here, you can wall jump. Oh, <laughs> maybe not. Uh, you can wall jump like this, right? So you can kind of just wall jump here, jump over here, wall jump here, uh, turn into a bunny hop, bam, bam, take that player down, quickly get some more momentum, and you just keep going and going and going. And some people are absolutely insane at it, as you can imagine. I'm not great. Um, <laughs> but I'll get there. Now that there's not so many crazy veteran players in the lobby, well, there are, but there's a lot more lower skilled players too. Like, why is it so hard to hit? If that was on Apex, I would have hit them, but maybe my sensitivity is messed up. I don't know. Oh, don't play here. Oh, yeah. Okay, next. Let's take a quick look at the weapons too. So you'll, there'll be some recognizable ones like the R201, the R101, there's the Hemlock, the Scout, the Flatline. We have um, Alternator, R99, R97 in this case. We have the Vault, um, Charge Rifle, you know, some pretty recognizable names. So let, let's try the um, Vault after this, this death. We also have different abilities, so of course I've picked the grapple. A lot of people like to go for stim, which is kind of like uh, octane stim. Personally, I'm more of a fan of the grapple. I mean, who's not, right? Yeah, it's a lot easier to use your full auto weapon. The wingman is pretty tricky. Oh. Look at that player go. Okay. Oh, player behind me. Ah, oh, they needed me. You can also cook grenades on this game, which is something you can't do on Apex. You can hold down the grenade button and then, uh, yeah, I mean, you can fight. Oh, that's a player right there. <laughs> like I say, um, don't come to this video expecting me to do well, but at least you can kind of see what the game's about. If you really want to, if you're like, it's on sale on Steam right now, but if you get Origin Premium, you actually get the, the game for free during the subscription. So you can kind of do that to get a test for it. Um, if you think like you're going to be bored, obviously if you're buying a lot of Apex coins, like, it might be worth doing that anyway. Oh dear. Yeah, it's definitely like a game where you just want to keep moving. Um, I'm not very good at moving. Obviously, because there's no titans in this mode, no AI, it's basically just you versus them, and yeah, you get pretty crazy. All right, and now this is the uh, sort of PVE mode, Frontier Defense, so you can choose um, which titan you want. Personally, I think we're going to go, uh, I'm going to go Legion, and you have like different upgrades, which is pretty cool. Oh. You get up there and destroy them. Mortar Spectres, well that sounds interesting. Harvester shields are dropping. Wait. I'm a pilot. Mortar Spectres, take them out. Okay. Oh no. Right, you can now like spend your money. Go buy some stuff. Whoa. This is like the respawn beacon. 
Um, okay, so... Amp weapons, yeah, I'll take that. Oh god. Get them away! Well, that's one way to do Oh god! That's not good. Stalkers detected. Get ready to take them out. I've got Titan. Do you wanna? Team, we've got a pilot down. It's okay. It's okay. Stick to the Obviously, yeah, this is easy mode. So everything does pretty quick, but I just wanted to show you this mode. Okay, now we have the strange Colosseum mode. You basically get put in a re an arena with just one other player. And if you win, you get rewards. Uh, I'm not sure what. Maybe cosmetics or something. I don't really know. I mean, as you can imagine, um, it may not be as easy as you think to hit someone. You'd think, oh, this is a nice easy spot. But because of the way the movement works, it's so hard to actually hit people. So it's a best of five, so the first one to three wins. You have to spend your points though, like as you level up you get points which you can spend on upgrading or buying new weapons. Um, and it costs ten of those points to enter this. But I think the rewards are worth it. Um, we'll take a look after. So yeah, here we go. I can see my enemy in my sights. As soon as I ADS though... <laughs> Never mind. I was going to say, if I ADS he's just going to be off, but he did the exact same strat as me. It's like a quick draw there. He won the fight. <laughs> so you get a Kraber and a Wingman, and uh, yeah, I mean, usually people are just running around all over the place. He's gonna try it again. He's gonna try it again, I know. This is where we just slide to the right, and then we'll just, oh, maybe not. They're all running on the side of the map. Go like this, dun, 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 dun. Ooh. Yeah, it's really hard. <laughs> it's definitely a good way to practice your movement though. Also, like, your aim, to be honest. This is a lot of what this game mode is about. It's just trying to hit people whilst you're running around like crazy. Like, if you stay still for too long in this game, that's when you die. Oh, if we get close enough, we can just punch them. <laughs> it's pretty cinematic. It's pretty fun. Oh, and another thing in this game, you have custom game modes. You can just create your own mode, invite your friends, and just have a bunch of fun. So, it's a def definitely a well-complete game. Now that there's more players, like, there has never been a better time to play it, for sure. I'm definitely going to play it a lot more, so, um, yeah, I'm really glad, to be honest. Ooh, that was close. We're not hitting these shots. I'm playing it like we would Apex by just sitting behind cover. Hoot! Oh, he's gone in for the punch. Okay, now he's, now he's mine. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, no. This is what the wingman looks like in... Um, uh, Titanfall as well. It's pretty cool. Oh, we hit him. Come on, we can hit him again. Oh, no. I forget you recover health so quick in this. Oh, hit him in the head. He's not even trying to shoot me, it's weird. <laughs> He's just busy moving. It's like, what do you focus on, the aim or the movement? I'll get like a bit of both. Ooh. Could have been it, but not quite. Stay still. <laughs> My problem is I'm not aiming well enough. But his problem is he's not trying to shoot enough. <laughs> there we go. So he won. So now we'll get some kind of reward. So, you know, you've got your customizable loadouts. You've got tons of leveling to do. There's unlockables. You have your titans. You have your pilots. Custom modes. The campaign is also very, very good. I definitely think this is worth playing. If you like Apex, you're probably going to like this. If you just like shooters in general, you're definitely going to like it as well. Um, let's see what kind of rewards we got, but either way, thank you so much for watching. I will put a link in the description if you want to check out, uh, this game on Steam for yourself. I mean, you can just find it on the homepage on Steam, honestly. So we get some credits as rewards. Only three, even though we spent ten. Bit strange. Um, 
yeah, it's really good. So I'll see you all in the comments. Cheerio. Did you know I stream almost every day from 7 p.m. UK time or 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time? You can catch me live right here on YouTube. So make sure you have notifications turned on. I also have a new members program. Become a member for $2.99 a month. Get your comments highlighted in videos. Get a cool badge in live stream chat. Get access to these cute emotes and also gain access to my members tips videos where you can ask me for any tips and I'll be making new videos weekly to help you improve your own game. Click the join button or click the link in the video description to get involved.